Hello friends. So you asked for longer workouts and this is your 30 minute full body workout that we're going to do together. And we're going to be working really efficiently for 29 minutes. We're going to do a cool down for one minute and let's get started. So just stand up straight and roll back those shoulders. Roll it back. Roll it back. And breathe. Let's go. Just step and step. Just a little warm up first. Yes, just get that blood flowing. Add a smile. Keep it up. Let's go. Step and step and step. All right, just think about being nice and tall and hold in four, three, two. Last one. Now lift it up and down. Up and down. And reach and lower. Up. All right. Hold it down in four, in three, in two, and last one. Just hold it down. We should roll back those shoulders. Just hold that little isometric hold. Bring those arms up to the side, and then just reach side to side. Just wake up that core a little bit. Breathe and breathe, breathe and breathe. All right, four, three, two, last one. All right, friends, grab those weights. I have some two pound weights and we're gonna roll back those shoulders and put those um, elbows right next to those hips, okay? And from here, we're gonna lift up those elbows and down, keeping that nice bend. Yeah, just breathe, keep it up, lift and lower. All right, so those knees are nice and soft, okay? And if you like, let's add a squat to get down and lift, and up, and lift, up. Yes, just feel that nice little, little oomph when you lift up those elbows. All right, we're gonna work those shoulders. Hold it up in four, in three, in two, and last one, hold it low. Bring back those, shoulders, those elbows a little bit longer. Open up that chest nice and big. Light grip on those weights for four, Three, two, last one. Bring it up, stand up nice and straight, and then just little pulses back. Okay, just little pulses back. I'm just gonna move around so you can see me. I know we're keeping up those elbows and just bringing those shoulder blades together. For four, three, two, last one. Now push it forward and back and forward and back. I told you we're gonna be efficient, right? I know sometimes people come to my class and they're like, oh, I want those longer, those heavier weights. I'm like, we're gonna do lots of good holds. All right, we're gonna hold it out in four, in three, in two, and last one, and drop it down, friends. Flip those wrists, roll back those shoulders again. We're gonna work those biceps. Just bring it up and down, and lift and lower from those thighs to those shoulders. Let's go, let's go. It's shoulders and thighs. All right, try to keep those biceps, those arms really close to that rib cage. Yeah, keep on breathing. So we're gonna do this workout really efficiently and effectively. So I know, you know, we all are short on time, so we're gonna just pack it in. But if there's any moment where you're looking for water, you wanna get hydrated, you want to take a break, you want to take a child's pose, do a modification, please listen to your body, friends. All right. Give me four more. And three, last two, and last one. Bring those feet together a little bit more and just little lifts, little lifts, little lifts. Bring it up and up and up and up. Just little lifts and lifts. All right, we're going to keep those little lifts but we're gonna flip those wrists. We flip them up and lift together and up. Yes, they, they face you, they face each other. Bring it up. Keep on breathing, lift. You got it. All right, let's go, give me eight. And seven, six, and five. You got four and three, last two, and last one, now they're together. Now take them down singles and singles and singles. Yes. All right, friends, that core is activated. 
That just means that you feel, just take your mind for a second and you're like, mm, I'm gonna tighten my stomach a little bit. That's it. And then just think about that posture. Just be nice and tall. Yes, all right. Now from here, we're gonna do both arms at the same time, but instead of going all the way to that thigh, we're gonna stop at that belly button. All right, in three, two, one, both arms. We take it down and lift and down and lift. So you see that stop, that nice intentional stop. Yes. So one of the reasons why I like the smaller weights, one is that they're really unassuming, right? Most people think like I can't get a good workout with just two pounds or three pound weights um, or even one pound weights or without weights. But it's all that intentionality that you put into that workout, right? For example, you're just thinking about just nice and slow and controlled movements. I think sometimes when we get those larger weights, we're like, oh, you know, we're like pulling up. No, your back is nice and flat. We're not flailing all over the place. We're just lifting and lower, just squeezing those biceps, extending and up. Yes, all these little reps, they're just creeping up on you. All right, I want you to hold it up in four, in three, in two, and last one. Now I'm just gonna turn so you can face me. We're gonna get into those triceps. We're gonna kick it back and lift it up. Kick it back and lift. Yeah, so I like to keep my, um, my fingers nice and loose on the weight. Just have those pinkies up and up. So I think about kind of like my pinkies, bringing it up a little bit higher, you know? All right, we're gonna bend it down in four. Give me three more and last two and last one. All right, so bend it down, friends. I want that back to be nice and straight, okay? We're gonna hold up that weight while I just talk a little bit about form because a lot of times in class I see this. So if you're doing that, just like lift those shoulder blades up those shoulders up, that chin up, and now we're just gonna pulse it up, pulse it up, pulse it up. Yes. All right, those, that, those knees are nice and soft. If you get uncomfortable at any time, you can always come back up here and just a little pulse it, but obviously the lower you bend, you're gonna feel it. Let's go, let's go. Give me eight, seven, six, and five, four, three, two. We're gonna take it back to those shoulders again. So we're bringing it up and back. Yes, let's go, let's go, bring it up and back. All right, we're gonna hold it back again in four, in three, in two, and last one. Now we're gonna flip those wrists again. So we flip them up and in and up and in and up and in for four more. We're gonna hold it up in three, facing the sky in two, and last one. Now we're just gonna pump it up. Let's go, let's go. Check that back, how's it looking, right? Just pump it up, let's go, yes. For four, three, two, last one, and hold it up, now from here. All right, keep those um, arms behind that booty and just lift it up. Just feel that power pose, right? And lift it up and down again. We lift it up and down, we lift it up, and down and hold it up. Little pulses, little pulses, lift it up. Yes, yes. All right, now from here we're gonna flip those wrists again. Flip it and down and flip it and down and flip. All right, for four, three, two, and last one. Nice and big, open up that chest. All right, friends, and then just bend, extend, and bend. Extend for four and three, last two and last one. Hold it up, friends. Hold it up. Just feel that power for a second, all right? Actually, for eight seconds. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Drop it down, shake it out. I have my coffee here, so I'm gonna take a sip. Nice little morning workout. All right. We're gonna roll back those shoulders again. And those knees are nice and soft. 
We're gonna start on that right leg, okay? We're just gonna lift it up and then take it up to the side, sorry. So lift that knee up and leg out. Now the standing leg is gonna be doing a lot of work. And I just want you to protect that knee. Okay, so it bends and it stays nice and soft. Don't wanna lock it out. Lift and slide up. Lift and slide and up. Yes. Also, I'm not doing this with shoes on, but in my classes I tell everyone that you know, if you feel more comfortable keeping your shoes on, some people like the feel on their you know toes and their skin. Some people like that extra support of their shoes. So, you know, it's just to you. All right, lift up again and lift. All right, up and slide and lift up. All right, this next one, we're gonna hold it out right there, hold it out nice and long. Now lift that leg down, up. Another thing is that how I put my hands, um, I hope it helps you, but if you feel better here, if you feel better with your hands on your waist, also if you feel better on these balancing moves to grab onto you know, a chair or some type of surface that helps you, you go for it. Don't let me stop you from having your best workout, okay? All right. Give me four more. And three, and two, and last one. Hold it out, a little balance here. And from here, we're gonna bring that knee up and then send it back to a lunge. Okay, so go side, up, lift, and side. Bring it up. And yes, I always snap. Up and side and lift. Again, let's go. Bring a knee up. All right. Yes. Give me four more. And three. Last two. And last one. I'm just going to move so you can see me here. So that back leg is nice and straight. And then from here, I want you to lift and lower. Bring those arms up. Yes. And up and down. All right, I want you to hold it low in four, in three, in two, and last one, hold it low, activate those thighs, reach up tall with those fingers for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, and bring it up. All right, friends, shake it out, and we're gonna do the other side. All right, so stand up, stand up nice and tall, open up that chest, and it like goes up, side, lift, and lower. Again, grab some water if you need it, and side, lift and lower, up. Keep it up, let's go, it's up and side, lift and lower. So you're working those lower abs here. Working on that balance and core stability, yes. Up and side, lift and lower, bring it up. Out, lift, lower, bring it up. Out, lift, lower. All right, friends, we got one more. And hold it out right here. Now lift that leg, we take it up and down. Try to point that toe, let's go, bring it up, down, lift. Again, let's go, remember those arms. Whatever works for you, bring it up and down. Also, for example, you could be like this. Bring it up, down, lift, lower, bring it up, down, lift, and lower. Hold in four. In three, give me two more. And last one, now we bend and we send that leg back. Okay, so move up a second. So we bend, out, lift, and back. Bring it up, out, lift, back, up, out, lift, back, up. Yes, let's go, let's go. 
All right, you have four. And in three. And in two. And last one. End it here, friends. All right, same position. We're going to take it up and down. Oh my gosh, I have my pup on the other side of this camera. And he's just taking a little snooze. His little tail is kind of you know, doing that little flutter. And up and down. I'm going to hold it long in four. In three. Last two. And last one. Hold it here. Reach up those fingers tall for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. Bring it up and shake it out. All right, friends. From here, again, grab that water if you need it. We're just going to take it up to the side, up and reach, and we're going to fold over and take it to a nice plank, okay? Breathe in, breathe it out, and then walk those hands back and lift it up. Friends, you want to stay down in that plank and just hold that plank that whole time. You can totally do that. Breathe it in and breathe it out. And walk it back. All right. And lift. And last one. We're going to hold that plank. Okay. So same as before. That back is just nice and long. That spine is nice and straight. We're making a straight line. And that navel's up to that spine. Hold for four, three, two, last one. Take those knees down and take yourself to a child's pose. All right, friends, and then take yourself to a club at upward dog. And then just shift that weight back and forth. So we work on those legs, we got those thighs, we're going to get really into those glutes here. Yes. And we're going to finish off with some abs. And then you'll be done. All right, we're going to shift our weight to a nice quad, okay? So you're on your knees, and we're going to come down. If you have problems with your knees, you can definitely roll up that mat, get a towel. Um, okay, so from here, I want you to bend, keep those bends in the knees. We're gonna start with the fire hydrant. We're gonna lift it up and down and lift and lower. Another thing is that you can come down here and lift and lower and up and down. Another modification is that you can be straight, but I wanna see your beautiful face and I just kind of like being in the air. All right, so we're lifting and lower. So you're keeping that nice bend. And the higher you get that knee, you're gonna feel it here, but you know, you may be here. Or this may be your 100th workout and this you could be here, but just wherever you are today. Okay, you're moving your body, you're doing something good, so. All right, we're gonna hold it up in four, in three, in two, and last one. All right, now from here, you have that knee up, and now you send it long, and you bring it in, and you send it long, and you bring it in, and it's long, in. So extend it, pull it in. You wanna bring it into that elbow, bring it in, out, in, long. Yes, like you're kicking that wall. All right. You're gonna feel it in those glutes. All right, now from here, we're gonna combo this. So we're gonna take that first move, that fire hydrant, and this extension, and then put it together. So we take it down, and lift, and long, and bend, and down, and lift, and long, and bend. Let's go. Down, lift, yes, take it down, up, out. Again, you got it, yes. Friends, we've been working out for 20 minutes at this point. We're almost there. All right, give me one more. 
Hold it out nice and long, hold it out. Just feel that force, sending that to those toes out nice and long. And then I'll just bring that knee in and out for seven, six, five, and four. Last three, two, and last one. All right, take it down, pound it out. And I'm just gonna flip over, we're gonna do the other side. Okay, so I'm down my forearm, get comfortable as you'd like, and lift that knee up and down, and lift and down. And down. Let's go, friends. Yes. Yeah, this is where it gets hard, right? Up and second side. Up and down. And again, lift it up and down. Yes. You got it. All right. Four more. And three more. Last two. And last one. Extend that leg long. Send it out. Pull it in. Send it out. Pull it in. Yes. Yeah, you got it. It's long. And in. Yes. Out. In. All right. You know what's happening, right? We got to do that combo. All right. Are you ready for it? Yeah, let's do it. So pull it in. Take it down. Lift that knee up. Send it long. Pull it in. Take that knee down. Bring it up. Send it long. Okay. Keep on breathing. Yes. Up, out, in. Almost there. All right, this is gonna be the last one. And we're gonna hold that leg out nice and long. Hold it out, stretch it out. Feel those toes, wiggle them. All right, and then pull in for eight. So it's eight and seven and six. You got five and four, last three, and last two, and last one. All right, friend, Whew. found it out. All right, roll it up. Again, we're gonna keep with that efficiency. We only got a couple more minutes to work. So we're gonna come down on our side. I'm gonna be on my forearm. Okay, that body is nice and long. That core is in, and bring up that knee and send it long, bring it in. So we've been working your abs, your core this whole time. We're gonna just do a couple more moves that will really just, you know, focus a little bit more. So working on those obliques here, lift and lower, up, again. Let's go, let's go for four and three, last two, and last one, now hold it here, hold it here. Now this is gonna be a little bit, but we're gonna bring this bottom leg up. So you're holding that core up. So you're gonna try to make a diamond with your feet. And I'm also sneaking in a little bit in the thigh work, so sorry. Actually, sorry, not sorry. All right, hold for four. And three, last two, and last one, hold it here. Now stretch it out long. Three more. You got it. It's two and last one. And feed it out. It's beat, 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 beat. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last one. All right. Come down on those forearms. I want you to pull in and send it out. And then pull in and send it out. If you want to keep those legs bent, you know, we're just going to work those lower abs here. In. You still got that energy. I know you do. Pull it in. You're going to finish nice and strong. All right. Give me four more. And three. Last two. And last one. Hold it down and just reach, 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 and reach up. Yeah, those legs are in tabletop. You're bringing those shoulders up. Get some nice space between your chin and your chest. You're reaching up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. And I'm gonna flip over, we gotta do the other side. All right, friends, nice and long. 
elbow out and pull that knee in and out and in out yes how are you feeling ready for this <laughs> all right Okay, according to my clock here, I got five minutes left, which means we're gonna work it more for four minutes and then just a mini, mini stretch. I have a couple of workouts, some stretches, some cool down songs that I'll link down below. I'll hold for four and three and two and last one. Now hold it and we're gonna do that move where you're putting that toe up and down and toe up and down. Hold that waist, yes. Again, let's go. Give me four more. And three. Last two. And last one. Hold it here and send it out. Pull it in. It's out and in. Out and in. You got it. All right, friends. Let's do four more. We're going to hold it out in three. Give me two. And last one. Hold it out and beat it. Beat, 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 beat. Beat, 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 eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, and send it down. Come back on that back. All right, friends, those arms are long. Up in the sky, those feet are long, and we're gonna bring it in, each alternating knee. So we'll lift it up. Friends, if you're feeling extra, and you don't like that bent knee, you can definitely take it. Do a straight knee, or you can alternate one knee straight, one knee long. All right, I'm gonna take it back to that bent up lift. Yes. All right, friends, lift. Okay, give me four more and three, last two, and last one. Now, nice and long. All right, we're gonna roll up really slowly, one a vertebrae at a time, and reach forward, and take it back. Nice and slow. Bring it up, use that breath, and then reach over, and take it down again. And lower one more time. All right, friends. Last one. All right, bring those hands behind your head. Final, final move. All right, we are going to do some bicycles. All right, so we're going to work that core, work that waist, work those obliques, and send it out and out, out and out. Yes. Keep it going. Send it out. So bring that elbow high up to that knee. All that focus is on that belly. Nice and strong. Those legs are going out. Yes, you got this. I have to say, this workout went really fast for me. I hope you really enjoyed it. <laughs> but let's keep on going. All right, let's show that power for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, last one, and take it down. Woo! All right, friends, virtual high five, high five, but let's just cool it down for a second. So breathe in and breathe out. Send those toes in one direction and your fingers in another. Now just bring those knees into that waist. Maybe grab onto those toes or those feet or the bottoms of that shoes for a little happy baby. Breathe it in, breathe it out, bring it together, and we're just gonna rock back and forth until we land on our feet. And extend those legs out nice and long. Pedal those feet. Shake your head yes. Shake your head no. Bend those knees slightly and rise up one vertebrae at a time. The head is the last to come up. Lift up nice and tall, reach to the right, reach to the left, 
and let's take a final deep breath together. Breathe it in, reach it up, and let it go. All right, friends, you are done. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me on this workout. Definitely check out my channel for more workouts and leave a comment below as to what workouts you wanna see. Just abs, just arms, 15 minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes. I love hearing from you and have an awesome, awesome day. Bye.